great to meet you, Chosen. So good great to talk to, to you. you. How are you yeah. today? I'm doing great. We look like we could be cousins, like or my auntie or something. <laughs> we I was like, like we favor, right? We could kind of be related. Uh, uh, yes. <laughs> Gotta check the archives on that one. I know. I know. <laughs> so love this story. Love the twist on the two characters. What do you love about getting to portray Elle? It's just a gift. It's a gift to to be able to, for one, come into such a beautiful story that uh, has passed through the generations like Cinderella. But to be able to add a, a twist to it, you know, to to add these awesome songs, these beautiful dance numbers, uh, the beauty of sneaker culture, basketball culture, it, it, it just really allowed me to pull everything in my toolbox out and, and put it into this one movie. So speaking of that, what is that process like for you combining two of your things that you love, two of the things that you work on into one project? Honestly, I always believe that they're, they're very, very similar. I, I started my career with music, being a singer and a musician. And I always said acting is singing without the vocal aspect. My job as a singer is to make you feel something more so than even sounding good. If I can just make you feel, that's what you play music for is to feel. And as an actor, that's the same thing. And as a dancer, it's about feeling. So I just try to say, who is L? And I feel like that's what Kicks represents. Kicks is you feel, you feel the bravado, you feel the fun, you feel the, the, the limitlessness, the, the lack of gravity. Nothing can hold me back. And I wanted that to be displayed in his vocals and his dancing and in the acting as well. Are you a sneakerhead? I gotta ask that. And if so, what did you learn about design and shoe elements in playing L? Well, L definitely has a uh, chosen beat when it comes to his dedication. For me, I was personally, I, I love Air Forces. So I've been a dedicated Air Force guy most of my life. I, I keep about three or four pair of Air Forces in my, in my crib at all times. <laughs> I keep them on rotation. But this film made me gain more appreciation for the, the manufacturing side. Because as a buyer, you don't spend much time thinking about, ooh, what really went into the designing of this shoe? You know, someone really put that soul together. Someone chose the laces, uh, the body, the shape, all of these beautiful, uh, these beautiful ideas that went into what I'm walking in. And I think there's something really special that you're living in art. It's living art. So speaking of that, Elle is obviously chasing or desiring something that is deep in his heart and he'll go far to get to it, right? Through mm -hmm. all the challenges. What is something like that for you in your life? Well, for me, uh, I chose I chose to be an entertainer, you know, and a, a lot of that before you, you work is a lot of faith, you know, and you go out, you go out there and you audition every day and you, you try to get better. And uh, you have a lot of I don't like to call them failures. I just call them learning experiences. And I think that's what really attracted me to Ella as well, is that, you know, you fall down six, you get up seven. It, it's just a process of, of keep on going, just keep on swimming. And uh, eventually one day you'll look up and you'll say, oh, shoot, I'm here.